One year ago, the life of a 22-year-old Calgary woman was taken too early and in a horrific way by the hands of a former boyfriend. Tonight, her family and friends mourned their loss but cherished her memory at a vigil. Nadia Eldeeb had gone out with friends when she ran into a former boyfriend. The night turned tragic when after leading a bar together, her ex refused to let her go home. He ended up stabbing her 40 times before shooting her to death in the northeast part of the city. The ex, Adam Bedahar, went on the run after police issued a Canada-wide warrant for him. He died in a shootout with police four days later. Nadia's sister says this year has been incredibly painful for all of the people gathered for the vigil tonight. It's been a, a roller coaster of a ride. Um, a lot of acceptance, denial, a lot of uh, anger, grief, just with the way that Nadia passed. Uh, it was very violent and traumatic for my whole family. So really, we've been just trying to help, um, help survivors and, and any women who have been through domestic abuse who have luckily survived uh, to be able to provide scholarships uh, in Nadia's name, um, to be able to get back on their feet and uh, to raise the awareness that domestic abuse is not a certain demographic for you to be, unfortunately, a survivor of domestic abuse, uh, but that it could happen to anybody. And Nadia's case was exactly that.